I had a chance to speak with one of the international guests here at the Memphis Paper Money Show, Michael Chu, who talked about what was going on with his auctions as well as the convention that's going to take place in Macau. Michael, you're here at the Memphis Paper Money Show. Why have you come to the convention? Well, this is a, the largest paper money show in the United States, and it's been here 40 years. You know, I haven't been here in a couple of years, but uh, I'm here because they is supposed to be the last one here. So, you know, I want to be here for the, for, the, for the last hurrah. Well, your auctions deal a lot in paper money, too. What type of banknotes do you primarily handle? Uh, we handle mostly Asian, you know, especially Chinese. You know, banknotes and bonds and, you know, other Asian banknotes. And how is that market? I mean, market's okay. I mean, it's not as strong as a couple of years ago, but it's uh, picking back up. At the Len Nye auction last night, the price was very strong. And I think Joe Schaefer did a great job. And there is a coin show coming up in Macau. Can you tell us about this convention that's taking place? Yeah, it's going to be on the December uh, 1st to December 4th. This is the third year, you know, that Macau is hosting an international show with international dealers. And uh, every year it seems to get better. The show is extended from three days to four days this year. Will there be exhibits and lectures? Uh, yes, uh, we always have exhibits on the on Friday this year, and uh, there'll be a special exhibit or some really rare Chinese coins this time. Last year we had the Ato Ben dies that went really well. How difficult is it to get to Macau? Uh, it's fairly easy. It's like going to Hong Kong. You know, there's the same customs, you know, no problems going in and out. So it's pretty easy. You know, it's like going to Hong Kong. And if collectors come to the show, what other things are there to do? Well, you know, we always release the Macau Panda every year, and that has gone really well. You know, in the last two years, the, you know, the, the price is about minimally double after, after the release of the show. And you know, people are pretty happy, you know, you, you get there, there's, there's always some new products, exhibits, and seminars. And what sort of things will be at the upcoming Champion Auction? Uh, we have some really rare Chinese coins coming up. Uh, we're right now preparing you know, the highlights. So it should be out in a couple of weeks. And you know, it's like last year, you know, we, we, we expect to have the, the rarest and the, the best coins every, you know, you know, at every auction in Macau. How can someone find out more information? Well, come to our website, you know, or you could just uh, contact you know, you know, us through our ads on Coin World, you know, more coin news. You know, the website is uh, cghka.com. Okay, well, best of luck with your ventures. Okay, great. It was nice to see you again, David.